Christmas Eve is just four days away and many families are planning to celebrate a little differently this year. The current restrictions in Minnesota do not recommend getting together with people outside of your home, but there are some guidelines. There are some guidelines if you're planning to do it anyway. Tonight, Kate Raddatz shares how some families will spend the holiday. It's a tradition for Heather to host Christmas Eve for her family. This year, it will be just her and her husband staying home. Both my husband and I work in healthcare, and we definitely knew early on that we weren't going to be, holidays were going to look different. The CDC is recommending people avoid traveling and stay home this year. The Minnesota Department of Health is not recommending gathering, but does allow gathering indoors with one other household with a maximum of 10 people. Outdoor gatherings can allow for three households with a maximum of 15 people. Social distancing among households is still required. Thanksgiving is really okay. You eat. You can eat wherever, right? Um, Christmas is more of like gathering about family and just like enjoying time together. Aaron and her husband are going to see his mom and sister, downsizing from their five Christmas celebrations, often with dozens of people. They've hardly seen any family since their first child was born in October. It's definitely been a struggle um, mental health wise, um, but yeah, just to be able to, I'm looking forward to it. Um, just to be able to be around other people. Several viewers shared they were exchanging gifts via Zoom. Others are quarantining before seeing family in person. Heather says she's focusing on a slower, more relaxed pace this holiday. It's definitely sad, but we're reframing it as new traditions for our family to make this year. Kate Raddatz, WCCO 4 News. More than 84.5 million Americans are expected to travel this holiday season despite restrictions.